What's going on lads, Hachi Fifi here, today I'm going to be bringing you another episode of Exotic Squads. Um, today we're going to be going with Senegal, um, and as always guys, if you do want to leave a comment suggesting teams I can use, um, you will be enter entered into a giveaway if I do choose you. So yeah, overall we're going with the 4-2. Two variation. This was a really, really good team. It's probably the best one we've used so far, um, and I would actually definitely recommend it. Um, starting things off in goal, we have Kamara. He's actually really, really good. Like he didn't actually let in many goals for me. Um, 74 dive and 61 reflexes. Six foot five. Expected a lot worse in my opinion. Right back, we have Sizoko. High, high work. 83 pace, 69 defending, and 76 physical. Um, he's pretty good really, he was probably one of the best centre backs, right backs I've used in a little while. Um, then we have Mbodji and this guy's ridiculous, 75 pace, 75 defending and 87 physical, 6 foot 4 and he's 92 strength as well, really really good stats on him. Then we have Sané, 71 pace, 76 defending and 81 physical, medium high whack rates, really really nice cheap gold centre back to use in my opinion. And then we have Mbengu, 77 pace, 74 defending and 76 physical, um, and he is 6 foot, he gets up and down the pitch quite nicely as well. Um, and then we have Sadio Mane, 4-star uh, skill moves, 90 pace, 78 dribbling and 70 shot, 13,500 coins, um, because he's fast and in the Premier League pretty much. Um, and then our left centre defensive mid is going to be Diame, 79 pace, 81 dribbling, 73 defending, 78 physical, 69 shot and 68 passing. Really, really solid all around stats for him and the same goes for this guy. Cheku Kuyate, 78 pace, 72 defender and 86 physical. Um, both of these are absolutely huge and work out really, really nicely in the midfield. Um, and they get forward nicely as well with Diame having some pretty awesome shooting on him. Right wing is going to be Su Salgu, maybe, 88 pace, 74 shot, 60, 74 dribbling, sorry, 66 shot, 62 passing, really, really solid stats, um, but he is mainly just there for the pace, really. Um, and then the right wing is going to be Mane Chief, 86 pace, 77 shot, 68 dribbling and 75 physical, 6 foot 1. Um, this guy is rapid and his finishing is really, really nice to use on the game. And then we have Sako, 83 pace, 74 shot. He's actually upgraded, um, that's why he costs 10,000 coins and he's obviously in the Premier League. So he is kind of looked looked out for in, in the game. But yeah, guys, we're going to move on into the clips now. And we will see how the team did before. So yeah, we will see you in a second. So in terms of how the team played, it was overall a really, really nice team. Um, scored a couple of nice goals with them. Um, in terms of the goalkeeper, yeah, he was pretty good. You could easily hybrid in another goalkeeper if you really wanted to, though. Um, overall, the defence was solid. They got up and back nicely. Um, the two centre-backs worked out really, really nicely. The midfield overall was really, really good. I'd definitely recommend Mane, Kuyate and Diame. Um, and then pretty much the strikers are just ridiculous. Saka wasn't that good. I'd rather get Babacar, the informed one or the normal one. He plays for Fiorentina. Um, so i definitely recommend picking him up. But overall, this team for like 80,000 coins, I think it was. Um, really, really nice team to use on the game. Um, would definitely recommend it. Uh, the best player in the team, in my opinion, was Mami Ajuf. Really, really good player to use. Um, and would definitely recommend using him. Um, and yeah guys, that has pretty much been the end of the video. Um, if you want to leave a comment, let me know who you want to see next. Um, and the support on this has been really, really good recently. So yeah, if you could keep up the likes and the subscriptions that you were giving me, um, I'd be highly appreciated. And thanks for watching the video, lads. Peace.